back to Lori Bites Likes. I am back with you. I'm doing a plan with me video, a new style for me. I'm doing a peacock theme this week. I have gathered up all my supplies, as you see, and I did pick up some fun things this week uh, to do this video with. with uh, Planner Chick Designs. I got her basic kit, and then I picked up some sponsored by coffee stickers. Um, I usually make my stamps, um, but I wanted to try this. I watched some videos. I really like to keep things cost effective. I don't like to spend a whole lot. This is my hobby though, and it's something I enjoy doing. So I wanted to give this a shot and see what I thought about it. Uh, I am doing a voiceover after the fact, and I discovered I love this way of planning, not doing stamps so much. Everything is there and ready to put down. What I'm doing, you guys, right now is I'm using a very thin washi, and I like to section off my weekend. That is my weekend. Tuesdays and Wednesdays are my days off, and... Uh, let me tell you, I take advantage of my weekend. It is Monday morning right now. I just, no, uh, no, yeah, it is Monday morning. I just got off. Um, today is Labor Day. I will be going over to enjoy some time with family today. Um, but I do section off my weekend. That's how I've always done it. I take a little sticky. It's just a visual for me. And then I'm running along, since in this peacock theme, I wanted to go with the colors that just made me think of a peacock. And that looked like it had some feathers to it, so I do run a, a white washi down at the bottom just to give it some color. So I'm doing that, and um, yeah, so I've got my washi colors picked out, um, getting all that down. We'll let you know ahead of time, I am kind of funny about my washi tape, and you'll see. I am not afraid to pull things back up if I don't like the way it looks. Probably some of you know this trick. If you don't, I'm going to let you in on it. If you do not want to give up space in your box or space in your column, but you still want some color over there with your washi, you can cut your washi down. And all you need is a good trimmer and preferably one that has lines so you can line it up. So when you cut it, it's going to be cut appropriately. Here I was just talking and not paying attention to what I was doing. I did talk during this video. It was an hour long video um, after I got done shooting it and I thought good grief they're not going to want to hear me talk through the whole video. So there I go. I slice it down, grab my tweezers, pull that little baby up, and then I've got a nice thin strip that's just going to cover that little line there and give just a little interest to your eye of course and um yeah and just trim it up as you wish and there you go now i am going to use that piece i'm not going to waste it i will add that over there you'll see i'm going to add it on the next page i'm kind of like where am i going to add this at and i end up going over those boxes just to give it a little more color to the page it's pretty happy about where it turned out. Don't always do that, but when I do cut a washi down, I'm like, you know what, I'm going to use it all. I mean, you know how it is. You end up with little bitty pieces of washi. So back to these little monthly things. I'm so tickled about this. And if you could hear me, you would just hear me screeching like a little girl. So the, the, the most enjoyable part of this was this daggum weekend banner. I was so excited to have a weekend banner. I usually don't have a weekend banner. And uh, I picked hers because she had a cute little Labor, Labor Day sticker that I was like, oh my gosh, you know, it says Labor Day up there by the 7th, but dang it, I just wanted to use that. This is something I make on my own. I will go into Pinterest and find things that I think are just adorable pictures and something that has a thoughtful thought on it. And this was one, it looked like a peacock to me. It was just lights, really, but it looked like a peacock to me. And I knew when I saw it, I wanted that as my thoughtful thought for my peacock week. And so I'm trimming it down so it just fits nicely over there under the thoughtful thought. And I just take some tape and um, 
just tape it on. I'm getting that Liberty sticker down using my little tape. Tape my color down so that the thoughtful thought is there. Um, hopefully, I'm going to do a picture at the end of this so you can see a picture of my spread, what it looks like when I'm all it's all said and done. And then you can read that if you want to stop and look at that. Now, the next thing I'm so excited about is having check boxes. I usually make my own out of a stamp and sticker paper. And, you know, I'll do that. It's not really that big a deal. But to me, this is just going to look so clean and uniform. And I'm so excited about it. Here's where I get anal about things, damn it. I just want things to be the way I want them to be. And I had noticed that with the check boxes, I was giving up a lot of real estate in my box over there on Wednesday that I didn't like. So pull it up, put it all the way over to the coil because that's where I want it to go. I don't want to give up too much space where I can write because let me tell you, I use my check boxes every day. I've said it a million times, I'll say it a million more. I cannot live without my planner. I just can't. Even though I work at home, um, that thing goes with me when I go out. Um, I have to have my planner. I have to have it. I have a work one, I have a home one, and that's the one I'm working in right now is my home one. I sat tonight while I was working and did my work planner. I will do a video about my work planner. It's not near as detailed as I get with my life planner. Um, so, you know, I don't like things to be uneven, as you can see. Um, and I don't like things to be hanging over the edge. So I pull things up, stick them under, and I'm happy. See, like, I mean, this is ridiculous. Do y'all do this? Please say yes, you do, because otherwise I feel like I'm just a nut. And that was driving me crazy because I could see a little bit of white there. So I went in and took some more, made a visual pleasing thing for my eye. I don't think anybody else would have cared about it but me. But I'm happy. So I covered up that little white space so everything looked boxed in and like it, I wanted it to. So anyways, back to the check boxes. And that one was driving me crazy because it was not laying straight. So I have to go, ooh, my tweezers, pull it up. And I was afraid that these would not pull up, but they had pulled up nicely so I could reposition it. So there we go. All right, so moving on. Now, I did not realize when I was doing this that I did not have all purple. I was thinking, man, I'm going crazy with all the purple uh, check boxes. I want check, purple check boxes all the way. And then I'm starting to see. I'm like, oh, shoot. Uh, wait a minute. Um, maybe I don't have all purple. But you know what? Hindsight is 2020, they say. And I should have put a gray one there in the middle. But I didn't. I kept purple on that side, which I'm fine with. I'm not perfect. Nobody's perfect. And then I keep going there and... Putting down my check. I'm mean, so stinking excited. See, that's what I used before. So I'm just like, woohoo, I don't have to stand, but I can just use check boxes and lay them down. And wow, this is great. So then I'm like, crap, I only have one more purple one left. So I decided to pull a gray one. Just bite the bullet, pull a gray one, put it down, and just take my last purple one. There we go. So, you know, I'm going to have all these gray ones. And why the heck don't they give you seven of the same color? Hello? I'm just asking. I'm not complaining. I'm just saying, hey, you know, why not? Then I realized that, oh my gosh, the other stamp that I make is usually, well, hold on. I have to take my brother's girlfriend back to the airport. They were supposed to come in for today, uh, Labor Day. He's a truck driver. And she was going to fly back to Texas, and she had asked me if I'd take her to the airport. It's close to Nashville. I said, heck yeah, I will, girl. And while I'm in Nashville, I'll do some shopping. So <laughs> you'll see that in a minute. So now I had discovered that I have stickers for my meal planning, and I do my meal planning down there at the bottom. Here I fidget a little bit. I'm like, I'm going to do gray and purple and gray and purple and gray and purple. 
because I learned my lesson up there with the check boxes that you don't have the same colors. So now I'm starting to go, wait a minute, okay, what's going on here? And then I realized I don't have seven of those either. What the heck? Okay, now I know today's Labor Day and it's Family Day and I don't have to cook tonight, hallelujah. So I'm like, fine, I just won't use one there. I'll just put them all on the nights that I am going to be cooking and planning for meals. And I found, I think you can see it, I found a little fork and knife and I decided I'd put that there. And I did write in labor, uh, no, I wrote in cookout um, there. So I just, you know, whatever. I learned my lesson on that one. So now here I'm thinking about, what was I thinking? Oh, now I'm getting my day out that I was going to have in Nashville until their plans fell through. He didn't get the load to come in. So I did have to redo that um, a little bit. And you'll see that in the picture here at the end. Um, but anyways, I'm thinking about that day. And then I, I mean, I'm so OCD and ADD. I mean, I just, I'm just, you can tell I'm like a little kid on Christmas with these three little sticker sheets. I'm like, oh my gosh, this is amazing. This is different. And um, so what am I doing now? What am I doing? Oh, she's got all the little functional stickers. That one is a washing machine. And boy, do I need to do laundry today. My second row I use for visual effects of things I need to do around the house. And, oh, I found a little shopping bag thing that she had. I mean, I had my plan all land out, man. I was going to Nashville. I was going to go shopping, the airport. That's a little planner book. And I was just showing you. I was talking, of course. And um, this one came. Um, this is one I ordered. It's all about girls' night and girly stuff. And this said ladies night out. And me and my two sisters that live here in town, my mom's getting up there in age and she's got some health problems. And we've been trying to on my Wednesday night off going over and just talking with her and being with her and just having a girl's night. So I like to always put something in there that just reminds me that is a special night and I'm going to dread the day that I don't do that on Wednesdays. It will be very sad. Now I'm going to my Etsy sticker binder. Does everybody have a sticker binder? It's so fun. So this is from Vandenberg Designs. I love her stuff. Go check her out. She makes the coolest little stickers for the month. Um, they're like national whatever day. And I love them. I don't always use all of them because there's a ton. Usually these crazy national days. Um during the week and so I find one that's on the 12th and guess what it's called it's called uh, National Chocolate Milkshake Day who would not want to celebrate National Milk National Chocolate Milkshake Day so I'm jumping all around I do have on my binder in categories there I am the little sticker sheets again um, I always do a little box. I don't know about you guys, but it seems like every week I have packages coming out. I don't really spend that much, but um, it just seems like every week there's boxes. I work for HSN, you guys, so I mean, I get a great discount. So, you know, if I'm selling it, sometimes I might buy it. So I usually have boxes coming from HSN. It's the big joke around here. What's coming from HSN today? Um... So here I'm putting down these again from that sticker sheet. Usually I just put my box down, but I'm like, by golly, I got little columns I can make with this. And I'm going to put a phone there because that's where I put down just a visual of all the phone calls I need to make for the week. That's a little prescription bottle. I like to fill my pills every week. And that just reminds me that on Tuesday I need to fill my pens. I'm going to take the trash off on Tuesday. I'm telling you, that second row is all my visuals, and I use it. I mean, I um, once trash gets taken off, there's a check mark going, check mark going there. And um, 
You saw I got the vacuum, I got my pills down, I got my trash. I got to use my spin mop this week. Who has a spin mop that loves to spin mop? I sure do. Um, so I know I've got to put my spin mop one down. What am I doing now? Oh, yeah, I'm still, still debating. Okay, Sweet Beans Plans. I love her stickers. So I got that down, the spin mop, and I know I need to do something horrible in the house. So I got to get that done. Tuesdays is when I do a lot of my cleaning. That's where you'll see all of my goodness gracious. I got to get everything done. Um, Wednesday, my shopping. I was going to, hey, I'm out. I'm going to do shopping. I'm still going to do shopping. Just not going to Nashville. Dang it. And that one was a little uh, coffee. I was like, if I'm going to be out all day, I'm going to Starbucks and I'm getting me a Starbucks. That's my little cooker. I do, I have a pressure cooker that is amazing. It's an, it's a very, um, oh, that's cute. I love that. This is my beauty section and that's where I color my hair. That's a visual I'll put on the month when I color my hair. And then I do my own gel nails. I do that to save a little money to feed my habit. So I have money for that, um, for planning. So I know on Saturdays, it's usually Saturday mornings, it's when I usually do my nails. So there's a little, little thing down. These are a couple of things that I have that I use for planning, but since I have my new sheets, I'm excited. I'm showing you again that I'm just still going off about the, the check boxes. Every week, I like to do a scripture that I can just marinate on all week and you can see I do it every week. These were Vandenberg designs. Um, I love these. These are so beautiful and every week I pick one and I usually pick a scripture that's on my monthly thing and um, I found this one. It was kind of an ombre pink. It looked had some of the purple tones in it so that scripture is going to go down there. This is my pet section and I've got to think about what I got to do for the pets. They both have special food and I found those stickers and love them. They have food right now, so I don't need to go buy their food this week. That will be next week. But I do need to put down a litter box for my kitty cat. Sometimes I'll use a paw print, but I found these litter, little litter boxes and I think they are adorable. That's the day I'm going to work on the litter box. And I like to change it out on that day once a week. And so that's done. Now I find I'm into my tech. I call it my tech one. Put down that little phone. I love that. That's the phone calls I need to make during the week. And so that's done. And you'll see what I do with that here at the end of this video. So anyways, let's keep going. Now my friend, my trooper friend, of course, has got me into The Walking Dead. And so I have been Netflix, doing Netflix trying to catch up because I haven't watched it. So I want to take that Friday after I get off work and try to, that's a battery charger. That really goes in with my work stickers because I always have to make sure my my iMac wireless mouse is charged for work because I use it like crazy. So anyways, these are my YouTube stickers that um, I had made and I'm kind of thinking about videos I got to make this week for my channel. What was that I put up there? Oh, that was about this video, about doing it and getting it edited and up. And then on... Um, Thursday, I'm going to do a video. What about this neat little contraption that I bought? You can see how I am recording overhead. I researched so many videos how people did this, how they set up their tripods. I found the coolest thing at Amazon and I'm going to shoot a video about it because I know I watch so many videos about how to do that. So that's coming Thursday. These are some that I made. I have a hot tub, and I'm going to be honest. I haven't used it a lot this, this year. I have a lot of problems with it, and uh, I decided that on Friday is going to be my personal day where I am going to enjoy myself. But on Thursday, I'm going to go out back. It's a fenced-in area where I have the hot tub, and 
get my yard work done, get some weeds trimmed. So on Friday when I go have my little day after work, my yard will look really awesome and I'll be able to just relax with a nice glass of wine and enjoy my hot tub. Now what am I doing there? I decided, oh, these are, this is my work schedule. And I decided to use the one that had a little computer on it because that's where I work at home on the computer. I decided to use those for my work schedule up there at the top. And I'm getting ready to go on vacation at the end of the month. And I usually don't put my work hours on my week. But shoot, I had these things and I was like, I'm going to put them on there. Plus the fact I'm trying to work all my hours. I do work full time, but... You know, we do work the third shift, and there's sometimes they'll say, hey, if you guys want to jump off of the phones, you can, but nope, I'm going to put that up there that says, Lori, you need to work. Now I'm going and finding a sticker that says today on it, and I ran those all across, but once again, you all, you only get six. Did I not learn my lesson? I did not learn my lesson on this one. So again, I'm we're going all along there, like today, today, all my little things I'm gonna do. Bam, here we go. I don't have another today. So I decided to use one that said personal on Friday when I'm going to do all my fun stuff and it'll just be a personal day. I'm not going to schedule anything that has to do with anything other than just TLC for myself. And then on that one, I wanted to cover that and I put odds and ends. So really that should say cleaning because <laughs> that's what I'm going to be doing. But we'll just say odds and ends there. Um, here I'm going to write down my work schedule. Just reminding myself, do not, do not give up my hours. Stay true to my hours this week. 9.30 to 6 a.m. is when I work, so I'm getting all that down. I think that will help me um, just, you know, say, nope, got to do it. And, um, or at least I think it will. I think it will help me a lot to not just take those hours off when they say, go ahead, take a few hours off if you want to. So, yeah, so you can see uh, the the top row is anything that I need to do, go, whatever. The second row is my visuals of, you know, things I need to do around the house. Now I'm just kind of looking again. I'm just, I'm just loving these. I just, I just love, I do. I just love, I'm going to have to buy my, my silhouette, I think. There, um. I put a little flag, so do you need to write out all my bills or pay my bills online today at some point um, and get all of that done. And then I love these little dots to make bullet points for like the phone calls I need to make. And again, I'm dancing around the gray and the purples and everything. And you know, I did have four phone calls to make, so that worked out. I was just kind of guessing. And here I'm throwing in my boxes that I have coming. And there again, I was guessing. And I actually hit the right number. I thought, well, I can add more if I need to. Um, I was kind of looking at what I did before. Um, what boxes didn't come. That was kind of glancing back to see what didn't come that I needed to fill. And now it's fun. I picked up these peacock stickers. I think I ordered these from Joann's. I'm not sure. But... Now the fun comes of putting in the stickers and just kind of decorating my page because I think I pretty much got everything down. I love that one, but I'm not finding a good place for him to be yet. Or her. I guess it could be a her. Yeah, I just haven't found a really good place for her yet. So still working on it and that's what I decided to go with because that's my personal day. I hope to not be writing a lot in there and then I'm like oh, where can I put another peacock and what color and you know all those things we go through. What color? What should it be? What should it look like? Oh it's just turning out so cute and then I found these peacock feathers because um, I knew I had this week coming up and 
I was just looking for peacock stuff and found these. So I thought, oh, I'll just dance this around this little thing there. Yeah, so everything is coming together. Um, now, here's what I do have to do. And I have to make my own stamp. I have not found an Etsy store that's made. And I keep my stamps in those little cases. I've not found an Etsy store that makes a pill that I can color in. I do have what's called adrenal insufficiency and I do have to take a very small dose of steroids a day to keep myself alive. So this is kind of an important thing that I have to have in my planner and um, to make sure you know that I've taken my medicine for the day and I have to take um, I have to take at least three doses a day, okay? So I color in, once I've taken them, I color it in, and that way I know. Let's say, for instance, if I passed out and they said, did she take her medicine today? My daughter knows to go look at this planner, and she would be like, she always colors in her medicine, so now I'm drying it. So I, I have to make that, that's the only thing, and you can see that's where I put them there at the top. And I, I'm great about coloring in, but I hadn't those last two days because we were busy, but she knew I took my medicine and she was with me. So now I just put them at the top, and as I take my medicine, I color in my pills. And so that's the only one sticker that I'm still yeah, I'm going to have to keep making until I find somebody that makes a pill sticker that I can color in. Um, most of them, they're, it's just like your vitamins or whatever, but the, mine is kind of critical. I have to have so many doses a day of it, and I have to keep track of it. So that's what I have to do. But I mean, it's not bad, I guess. So now I'm just like looking at my, it's like it turned out pretty. I'm so happy about it and happy with everything. I think I'm going to do a little more decorating here. I'm not sure. Um, I'm still talking, y'all. I talked the whole hour. I did take a break in the middle and made dinner. But now I'm showing you kind of what my to-dos looked like before last week and what it looks like this week. So tell me what you think. Do you like the new way? Do you like the old way? What do y'all think? Um, I think I'm really liking this. But now I don't know if I'll buy monthly things every month. I don't know. I'm not, I haven't decided. Um, so yeah, just tell me what you think. Now I'm going, I still want more. I want more of those. So I'm like, I want to use those. I want them somehow in there. So I did. I settled on that one. And I'm going to, I made a note on there, finish season four of The Walking Dead because I have my TV there. And then on that one, I decided that the YouTube sticker didn't have to be alone. It could have a little sticker for its sticker. And then I wrote on there what I was going to film. And I wrote on there about finishing The Walking Dead. Dead. Did I do anything else? I'm looking over here at my planner as we're talking. And no, I'm just kind of looking. I think I did. I think I did. I think I went back in. Yep, I did. I went back in with more peacocks because I was like, gotta keep going with peacocks. Gotta have some more peacocks up there. I found some little feathers and um yeah. So oh it's glitching here. Hold on. Okay, so I'm back. I had a little glitch there, but anyways, I was playing around with um, the rest of my peacock stickers, just kind of filling in empty space, and uh, anywhere I didn't think that I had to write anymore, so you know how it is. You want to add more stickers, so that's what I was doing. And so, anyways, I'm done. Um, I had a great time making this spread. Um, I'm going to, I think I was saying that I was going to do, um, showing you how I did my September, but it's too late. I already did the September. I'll take a picture of that, throw it here in the end. 
Um, but anyways, thank you so much for watching, and I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, thumbs up if you liked it. Uh, let me know if you want to know where the stickers came from. I will do a couple of shots of my spread and then the September. I did finish up um, that one. I was going to do a video about doing September, but I went ahead and did it. I've got some really cute, we have a vacation coming up at the end of the month. And I was going to wait and do that then. But anyways, I didn't. And I went ahead and finished it. So thanks for watching. Lori Fikes Likes. Live, love, laugh. And I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.